I call this the cedar stump pool. It's a popular watering hole for wildlife, and it's a hot spot for camera trapping. The cedar stump in the background was charred by a wildfire in 1930. It was here in early July that my camera traps recorded the three bears for the first time. The cubs were about five months old. The dark one is a female, and the larger khaki-colored cub is a male. My guess is that mom is about five years old, and that these two youngsters are her first litter. Mom visits the pool often, but sometimes the boy cub is in a scrappy mood. As you can see, the youngsters were fascinated with camera trapping. They rarely passed up the opportunity to learn more about my cameras. And as for girl cub, well, she did an excellent job of cleaning the lens. She was also better at following her mom, at least when mom was on the go. Boy cub, on the other hand, was perhaps more adventuresome. The rubbing tree was an attraction for all bears in the neighborhood, but especially for boy cub. After relieving an itch, mom waylaid her prodigal son here at the rubbing tree and showed the little tough guy how to wrestle. By a stroke of good luck, an overhead camera recorded her technique, while Boy Cub imitated a teddy bear losing his stuffing. For five months, the cameras recorded the comings and goings of the family. They were rarely in a hurry, but some of the clips do drag on, so I doubled the speed to keep your interest. Sometimes the cubs fell behind. And then raced to catch up with their mom. At other times they followed her quite closely. If there was a laggard, it was usually boy cub. This clip of Three Bears on the Move is my favorite. By the 12th of August, the cubs were noticeably bigger, but they weren't fat. Now salmon were moving up Butte Creek, and acorns, blackberries, wild grapes, and manzanitas were abundant. The three bears all but disappeared in September and October. But 10 weeks later, on October 28th, they made an appearance at the Cedar Stump Pool. They were all fleshed out and fluffy in their winter coats. On November 8th, the largest fire in California history burned the town of Paradise, part of Megalia, and large parts of the Butte Creek and Feather River Canyons. Only a few miles away, my cameras recorded peaceful scenes with an ominous soundtrack of firefighting planes overhead. In early December, one camera recorded the three bears as survivors of the fire. <laughs>